Okay, the question is a program P reads in 500 integers in the range 0 to 100. So there are 500 integers, but they are in this range. Okay, is this fixed range, and these this range represents the scores of 500 students. Okay, so there are 500 students, and they have their scores between 0 and 100, as usually you have in your exams. It then prints the frequency of each score above above 50. Okay. What would be the best way for P, P is the program, to store the frequencies. So, you have these 500 students, okay, these are 500 students and what else you have? They, they have scores, okay, so the scores are between 0 and 100, okay. And then, uh, what you have to do is, you have to print the frequency. So what is the frequency? So out of these 500 suppose if you take like let's talk about the score 68 so it's like like the, you can get 68 out of 100 that's the score and the frequency is like how many students got this score okay so there are these 500 students and if suppose let's say 20 students okay so the 20 students got this score of 68 so the frequency will be 20 and for score 68 okay so for score 68 the frequency will be 20 so that's the idea of frequency and what you are interested in this you are interested only in the frequency of scores above 50 okay so what you can do is you can have an array like this okay you can have an array and uh, just giving you this is not the final answer just giving you the the possibilities okay so okay so this is supposed some array and it, it tells you this it the array the indices of the array are the scores okay so let's say the indices are like this so this is index 0 this is index 1 this is index 2 and so on up till this is index 99 and this is index 100 okay and then what you can do is as you read these scores these scores of 500 students as uh, you do you can keep keep giving the frequency to these arrays right so what you can have is in the beginning you can give zero before reading anything you can give the value of zero to this complete array and as you read a score let's say you read two so you will increase this zero out here okay this zero will become uh, one okay then you read another two so this will become two so that's the value that will keep on increasing so this way when you will be done with reading scores what you will have stored in this arrays will be exactly the frequency okay so that's it but since you are interested only in the frequencies that are above 50 so you don't need these you don't need to store these frequencies before 51 okay all you need is to store from actually from here okay so you are only interested in these frequencies okay from 51 to 100 and you can store them in this manner okay you see that value you increase you see that score you increase these values and they'll store the frequencies so this so you only need an array from 50 index 51 to 100 which is an array of what 50 numbers that's all you need to store these values you don't you don't need these because you finally need only you have to concentrate only on scores above 50 and and that's the idea behind this okay so which means that this option a is correct